Item Number SCP-3824 Index Dog Pile Object Class Safe Special Containment Procedures Members of the MTF Omega-21 Savage Garden Disguised as the local park rangers are tasked with monitoring the area around SCP-3824 and suppressing the public knowledge regarding its anomalous properties. All subjects experiencing SCP-3824's effect are to be misinformed or, if deemed necessary, administered Class A amnestic. Any subject describing such symptoms as a minor pain in various body parts or obsessive thoughts related to barking after entering SCP-3824 is to be moved to the nearest Foundation facility for further study. Image SCP-3824 Description SCP-3824 is an area measuring approximately 40 square meters located within a park in the town of Oregon. Upon entering SCP-3824, an individual will be subjected to a minor mind-affecting phenomenon and will spontaneously visualize a large number of domestic dogs, Cardis lupus familiaris, hereafter referred to as SCP-3824-1 instances. Although the visual appearance and breed of the instances vary on a case-by-case -case basis, most subjects described them as being remarkably small, 2 through 10 centimeters in length, along with the head and body, as well as possessing a large amount of fur. In all situations visualized by subjects, SCP-3824-1 instances were observed to exhibit an ordinary, non-violent behavior and demonstrate a positive attitude towards the subject. Since the initial discovery, only one exception was documented. For more detail, refer to the Addendum 3824.1. SCP-3824's effects will typically cease after approximately 10 minutes following the subject exiting its area. If an ordinary canine enters SCP-3824, it will demonstrate aggressive behavior. In most observed cases, Canines produced continuous vocalizations until they were removed from the area. Addendum Experiment Log 3824-C D-1318 was ordered to enter SCP-3824 and remain in the area of its effect for 10 minutes. This subject was chosen for the following test due to their history of animal abuse and negative overall attitude towards canines. Upon entering, D-1318 reported experiencing SCP-3824's anomalous effect and reacted aggressively to it. Approximately three minutes later, D-1318 had claimed to experience discomfort due to obsessive thoughts related to canines and barking, as well as a minor pain in different parts of the body. After ten minutes of the experiment, D-1318 was allowed to leave SCP-3824. Following the subject leaving the area, the anomalous effect ceased as normal. Over the course of the next three days, D-1318's mental state had deteriorated dramatically due to constant obsessive thoughts and visualizations related to open wounds and bleeding. Reportedly, in the images visualized by the subject, the amount of blood and the size of wounds had gradually increased over time. D-1318 expired for unknown reasons four days later after the experiment. During the subsequent autopsy, members of the medical team were subjected to a mind-altering phenomenon similar to that of SCP-3824 and spontaneously visualized a large number of small, 2 through 3 cm in length, organisms visually similar to canines emerging from a human corpse and running away in various directions shortly after. The anomalous effect ceased approximately five minutes later. The autopsy performed following the demanifestation of anomalous effect showed no internal injuries within D-1318's body.